Welcome back, 737. We have something really exciting to look forward to. U.S. Figure Skating Championships are coming to Sprint Center in January. It starts with the uh, building of the ice on January 10th and continues with the championships about two weeks later. 41 Action News is the TV partner for this event, and we are proud. That's right, and we are pleased to welcome Ramsey Baker this morning. Good morning. Welcome to KC. Good morning. Thank you very much. It's great to be here. You guys are here doing kind of a... a Looking at things in the Sprint Center, a lot, a lot takes place. You guys are really busy this last month. Yeah, very busy. You know, we've got the holidays coming up, but uh, we don't have much of a break back in our offices. We're trying to get ready, and we're working with the folks at Sprint Center and also at Independence uh, at the arena to get ready for the championships just a month away. How big a deal is this when we talk about impact and we talk about the people involved here? Uh, you know, there's there's hundreds of people locally in the in the market who will come and help volunteer and put on this event. The Sprint Center staff, the Independence staff. Um, we'll bring, you know, 25 uh, or so people in from our offices in Colorado Springs. Um, so it's a big deal. and It's a very coordinated effort. I think about the names that are coming here that we get to see in person. Ashley Wagner, uh, Gracie Gold. I mean, not only are these former Olympians, we get a chance to see some future Olympians likely too, right? Uh, without a doubt. You know, and, and Ashley and Gracie both on the Olympic team in the past. Jason Brown will be here as well. Um, you know, all of our top skaters, and these are the hopefuls for 2018 in the Olympic Games. Do you get so excited seeing the little skaters in the audience? <laughs> this has got to be life-changing for them. Yeah, I think it's a great opportunity for skaters in the local community to see some of the stars of today and hopefully inspire them to be the stars of tomorrow. We know they're excited. We talked and we all found out about this about a year ago, yeah. and Kansas City's been looking forward to this since then. And this is important because 2018 uh, Figure Skate Championships is just a month before the actual Olympics. So this one, they've got to get their routines down. They've got a year to kind of practice and, and really get um, narrowed in or targeted in for the Olympics. This really sets the tone for the next year for these athletes. Uh, they're going to come here. They're going to hopefully qualify for the world team. And this year's world team will actually determine how many spots we get in the Olympic Games in each discipline. Oh, my gosh. So this is really step one. It definitely is step one of many that's going to take place between now and February of 2018. Wow. Some of the events we can see coming up in a month or so. Uh, you know, we have all of our disciplines, so, you know, pairs, dance, ladies and men, um, but at all different levels. So um, whether you're interested in seeing kind of the hopefuls of the future, uh, you know, the 10, 12, you know, 13-year-olds or those who are going to go to the Olympics, you're going to be able to see it all. Are there still tickets? Is it everything sold out? or? No, there's definitely tickets still available, um, and there's a lot of different things to come from the families of skating. Skating Spectacular on Sunday at the end where you can see everybody or the competitive events, the live ladies finals on Saturday night. You have a really cool way to get tickets as well, right? Talk about this movement. Yeah, um, U.S. Figure Skating's um, kind of gone on this journey now of a get up campaign. And this is a campaign that we're trying to promote the idea of skating and what it does for people in their life. But really celebrating the fact that everybody falls in life just like you're going to fall in skating. It's not always perfect. Um, but when you do fall, it's how you get up that really matters. Mm -hmm. And so we're trying to call attention to that. So we've launched a campaign, um, wegetup.com, and, and talking about get up. But we're going to specifically, in celebration of the championships, bring it here to KC and have uh, Get Up KC, um, where we're going to encourage people in the local market to share their stories of how they got up, maybe a friends or family, or if there's an organization that they admire in the community who's doing great things, to submit those stories to us for a chance to get honored at the championships and also potentially win tickets. Hey! Super cool. I love the idea. Just yeah. how we all, no matter what happens to you, it's how you handle it, right? Yeah. Th that's true. I mean, we, we say that, uh, you know, ice is slippery and so is life. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, you know, we focus on that getting up and not the fall because that's really what's important. If you've ever fallen, like, on ice, you know how hard it can be, Oof. especially yeah. at the speeds you guys go through on the, in the rink. And in front getting of millions. Up from it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Getting up from that, not easy, but it, very inspirational for many people. When we talk about the, the impact this is going to have, Tens of millions of dollars, I'm guessing, on our local economy. Yeah, tens of millions of dollars on the, on the local economy. And I think it's just another championship-level event coming to the Sprint Center. And the team there has done a tremendous job working with us. So I think it's a credit to um, the Sports Commission, Visit KC, and the, the Sprint Center for bringing this event to the, to the city. And the city's changed a little bit since it was here <laughs> last. Yeah, 1985, and we were at Kemper Arena at the time when that wow. happened. So it, it definitely has changed. New venue. Um, uh, different feel to the city, but the same people, and that's what's important because uh, we think the people of KC will really step up and support Get Up, and we're looking forward to, for them to um, share those stories with us so that we can help tell those stories to a wider audience. Where do they share those again one more time? Uh, you can share them at getupkc at usfigureskating.org. All right. Thank you so much for being Great here. Great to get involved. Yes. Thank You're you welcome. so much. Yeah, thanks for having me. We really appreciate it. We're looking forward to January. Best oh, of luck so getting ready. Yeah. <laughs> Lots of work to do. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you so much.